Oh, the last time at the police station in Zgirsh, I was asked the question what it feels like to experience directed energy attack because I did mention the issue and I feel I have not explained very well uh, what, it, what, what it feels when. And so what I, what I want to do today, I want to be really, really detailed about uh, exactly what it, what it feels like because I have a lot of, um, you know, kind of a few idiotic to say experience in this field, you know, being subjected to a torture with directed energy weapons. And in a little bit, you will understand why I feel like this. Today, tonight, I should say, I have experienced... Um, it didn't happen the first time. It did happen about a dozen of times. It was like... How can I say? In my opinion, it stimulates certain nerve areas because it feels like almost I'm not gonna say if something would be climbing on you but it, it feels like you know something like this is if you would let's say this area here you will have nerve stimulated nerves nerves not nerve but nerve stimulated it feels like they're moving it's like moving and you can feel the same thing when it goes when they hit you in the head with that stuff in the sleep then what happens is, and it happens so even inside of the sleep, even when you sleep, it feels like um, exactly the same I have experienced in Slovakia at the police. And Slovakian police hit me several times with the idea to knock me off the feet. It makes you lose like, like you would lose balance. What that feels like, let's say, if yeah, let's say you would walk and all of a sudden you would feel like you are, you don't, it's like, it seems to me like the best described would be as if you, you lose a touch what exactly you're doing, that you're walking. So it kind of feels like it, it, it turns around the whole, the whole thing, the whole picture in your mind. That's basically what it feels like to be hit with directed energy in the sleep. Uh, I should say with this type of energy in the sleep. And so I'm not going to talk about what it feels like to be hit with directed energy weapon, but instead with directed energy weapons because they use a variety of weapons. This is what particularly was used on about, I estimate, about a dozen occasions here in Poland. It's at least what I can estimate, maybe probably more. But I, this is what I, my memory can recall. And since it didn't make any sense to complain about a stuff like this, why should I? Uh, why should I just go every day and complain about a stuff like this? In a little bit, in continuation, I'm going to also explain you how they have seen this thing as why I should not even complain about the stuff, uh, stuff they do to you. I should be quiet about the stuff like that. The other type of uh, directed energy weapon torture, whatever that was used here in Poland. First I'm going to do Poland, then I'm going to remind you what happened in Slovenia. Was the weapon that was used to wake me up exactly two hours after I would go sleep. Sometimes even one hour when I would go sleep. But most of the time exactly, punctually, like two hours after you would go sleep. And then again, punctually, almost punctually at 6 o'clock, before 6 o'clock. Uh, between 5.30 and 6 o'clock always. But I estimate I would be waking up at about like 5.40, 5.50. What it feels like is that you got enough sleep, enough sleep already, like when you wake up like after two hours, when they, it feels like if you wouldn't have a watch, you would go about the business because you would feel that you have got, that you got the sleep, that you got enough sleep to rest, that you got enough, that you already got entire night sleep. But once you would get up, then you would feel that you didn't really get any sleep within like 
20, 30 minutes, it will come to you that you didn't really get any sleep. You, the sound in your head would be blasting. Uh, this is exactly what that feels like. Uh, your sleeping pattern is ruined, is screwed up. You're sleep deprived, you're tortured. Uh, an idea is basically to bring you to cardiologists on the table, to cardiologists, so they can do some open heart surgeries, put some peacemakers and stuff like this, because it piles up, because you're not allowed to sleep in this center. They they do this. This was a prime. This is the primary idea. This is the goal of this whole thing. Okay, on one side you have creating noise, all kinds of stuff using directed energy weapons to deprive you from the sleep um, on the other side if you disregard you continue to do the stuff you want to do whatever it is that you want to do um, it's like they start to express concern for you like why is it that you don't go sleep and the coughing starts again and sneezing like crying and shit like this they do it so they have just as i was saw the case they would be they would get like different groups do different things do different tasks basically they're very coordinated the stuff they do um the third type of weapon i have experienced directed energy weapon in that i am going to talk now about slovenia that's a weapon that is That's a weapon that is, how can I say, would leave you like bitten up, like some, like let's say you would, I don't know how many of you have you ever tried, like let's say boxing or something like this, sports, and you would go in the ring and you would have a sparring and it would be really tough the next day you would feel like you were like totally bitten up that's basically exactly how that other weapon works uh you need about except that you are weak except that you are experiencing like a total like confusion experience you you experience like you don't know where you're you know the simple tasks like grab things and go about it they become almost the impossible because you have to place extra energy to it you're confused um, the muscles are like I said you're bitten up from it uh, and it takes about 10 hours 12 hours to get yourself together to somewhat somehow normalize yourself um, that pretty much is how it feels to be attacked with directed energy but this is yet nothing compared to the idiots I was around here in Zgersh uh, and were brought along with Donald Trump from United States of America this idiots, these animals, these brutes insisted on how I should where am I, where am I, you are in the city where you will be killed this was the frequent explanation to me in the future this is where you will be killed and they have inside and suggested how you should run how you should just go don't stay if you will stay and that this place is far located and they're gonna radiate you also the veins on your legs they're gonna destroy you that too so you're not gonna be able to even walk to the city and shit like this this is the stuff this is the type of people I'm talking about and that if I will be talking about the radiation, stuff like this, I will get not only cancer, but I will have holes in my brain. Definitely will have them. It's what I was told because when you will, your example will be used to prove that this kind of stuff exists, that this was actually done to you. And so if you will talk about the stuff like this it definitely will have to be done to you the stuff like this so you're gonna have a proof this is the kind of people psychopaths real psychopaths Donald Trump have brought with him from United States of America not all of them but there were tough cookies like this too 
uh, most of these people were nice people, but there were some tough, tough cookies like this uh, that embrace this type of uh, viewing on things, basically. Uh, you know, the type of viewing on things is basically when you when you kill the person it, and it's really, it's nothing. Uh, you know, the type of viewing that, you know, you can just kill people. Just kill and not be affected at all, basically. The type of attitude is you can do anything you want to do and nobody can really do nothing to you. This is the type of stuff I'm talking about. So, I hope I was clear about exactly what it feels like um, not only to be hit with directed energy weapons, which I deem was a variety that was used, was not only one, um, but also even worse to be around the idiots that, you know, are worse than directed energy weapons, psychopaths that are out there basically to kill uh, literally for the pleasure, for the pleasure of it. I don't have anything else I would add to this. Uh, when you are hit with this regular directed energy weapon I have mentioned that wakes you up at 2 or 6 o'clock in the morning, then you have this sound, this hypertension sound, it stays for the rest of the day with you, calms down somehow towards afternoon uh, but it doesn't do you any good because you go back to this Shrodek to the center and you get hit again and so on and so forth that's all there is to it so a little bit difficult right to be around the people like this uh, to deal with this kind of issues that's all